What's up guys? I have another mystery box from back of the closet as you can see right here. I got one from them a couple videos ago and that one was so good. So I had to ask them to make me another one. So thank you to them for making me another one. But here it is. Hopefully it's just as good as the other box. I made about a little over 300 profit off their other box. So, so again, hopefully this one's just as good. But let's get straight into it now. So here we go. Let's get straight into this. Again, I paid a thousand dollars, so here's how it's looking. I think there's like four or five shoes in here. So let's go ahead and start off with this Nike box. And ooh, it's the, uh, it's the orange something. But this is a size 11 and a half in women's, so a 10 in men's. There is that, but that's not anything too bad. Brand new as well. So I know these are going for a good amount. Like this is... This is a pair of dunks that is going little, for a little more than the other pairs. So, really good start to the box, but this is the first shoe, guys. So, these are called the orange, or the laser orange, and then an 11 and a half women's. Look how much it's going for. Like, this is going for more than panda dunks. And panda dunks is like one of the most popular dunks. So, But you can see, it's also going for more than all the other sizes except 12 women. So, a um, really good shoe right here, a money size. I'm gonna mark it at like 480 based off the lowest ask in recent sales. So 480 with the first shoe. So let's go with this. This is already open, so we're gonna see what it is right now. Oh, oh wait. There's no way these are brand new. It can't be brand new. Let me see. Okay, so a used pair right here, but Obviously, a really good shoe, a Jordan 1 top threes. But dang, these are clean too. Let's see if this is a size 10 or not. Size 11. Damn, but. So here's a look at the condition. Like, these are super, super clean. I would say they're like a 9 out of 10 condition. The only thing I would say is slightly dirty bottoms, but it's not bad at all. Like, look at how clean these are. OG all as well, extra black, blue, and red laces with the white laces on right now. But dang, I think I paid a thousand <laughs> for this box. But yeah, this is the second shoe, guys. Some Jordan 1 top threes in a size 11. And the ones right now, a size 11. Um, kind of hard to price this. More recent sales around like, around, I would say like 600. So this being slightly used, I'm gonna mark it at like 420. Just cause for like a super hype, uh, like expensive shoe like this, people aren't gonna wanna pay too high for used cause they rather just pay the extra amount for a brand new. Just from my experience, so. But anyways, that adds up to 900 already with the first two shoes. I just checked my DMs with him. This is a $1,000 box. So already at 900 with three more shoes to go. And you can see right here, back of the closet, 1050 Okay, so it's 1050 I guess he added the $50 for shipping, but I mean, it looks like it's going to be worth it. So here's this Dunk, or I think it's the Dunk, Nike box. Small size right here, three and a half, five in women's. Here this is. These are brand new as well. Don't really remember when these came out, but. Either way, I mean, it's a dunk. It's a good shoe, so. This is the third shoe from the box, guys. And this is going for a really good amount for a small size. I'm gonna mark it at, like, 200. So I'm at 1,100 just like that. With two more shoes to go. It's a big box right here, so it might be a big size. But they are some... Jordan 5 Grapes, and don't tell me this, this is brand new as well. It's going to be crazy if this is brand new. The Fight Club is still on and everything. Sheesh, so another DS pair, Jordan 5 Grapes, in a size 13 and a half, so a rare size as well. It says right here, brand new with yellowing from the aging, so dang <laughs> He really hooked me up with this box. This is a really good shoe right here. I'm pretty sure it's going for a good amount. So 
So let's check market on it. So it's gonna be kind of hard at prices because market on it is kind of weird. And there hasn't been any, it doesn't show any recent sales. So kind of hard to price it. I'm gonna mark it like in between. So let's say, let's say 280. You know, size 13 and a half is more of a rare size too. So it might be a little harder to sell, but either way, 1380 with that, with one more shoe to go. And looks like this is gonna be a Jordan 4 box. Yep, Jordan 4, size 13. So another big size here. And these are... Oh, there's the alternate Bel Airs. Pre-owned though, so they had a market at 250. I don't really know market on this right now. Haven't checked in a while, but when these first released, they were going for around retail. So there's them creasing all around. Not in bad condition at all though, so that's good, but this is the last shoe from the box, guys. Some Jordan 5 alternate Bel Airs. And those, they had it marked at 250 A brand new pair is going for about like, I'd say, let's just say like 280 for a brand new pair, just based off the most recent sales. So this being slightly used, it has some creases all around. Um, just from my experience of two, these don't really sell that well. Like they're kind of hard to move. I'm gonna lowball myself and mark it at like 170. So that puts me at fifteen fifty for this one thousand fifty dollar box. If I am able to sell it at those prices, that is five hundred dollars in profit. So huge shout out to Back of the Closet. Here's a look at their Instagram again. This is my second box from them. I had asked them after the first one to make me another one because it was so good. And as you can see, they hooked me up again. So huge shout out to them. Thank you so much for these boxes. But let me know what you guys think of the box and leave it down in the comment section below. I'd easily rate this a ten out of ten. Can never go wrong with these shoes that I just got and the profit. There's a lot of profit to be made. So anyways, that's going to wrap up the video, guys. If you guys haven't yet, please subscribe to this channel. Leave a like on this video, and I'll see you guys next time.